You have a wicked, tortured ice landscape. Stunning interaction of volcanoes and glaciers. Infinitely beautiful, but then moments of sheer devastation. You better come to Iceland soon, because in a hundred years, it will certainly be a different landscape. A lot of people call Iceland the land of fire and ice. Iceland lays right on the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. About 56 million years ago, the North Atlantic began to split apart. Literally, the country is being torn at the seams. That's why you have volcanoes there. All of Iceland is made from volcanoes. They lie under glaciers. And when volcanoes erupt under glaciers, you get a totally different kind of form, a bit more explosive. The largest and most destructive event in the last 1,000 years occurred in 1783. The eruption produced an ash cloud that blocked the sun. It killed at least a quarter of the population of Iceland. The ash cloud produced the year without summer in Europe. Climate change has certainly had a very strong impact on Iceland. Glaciers of Iceland reached their maximum extent about 100 years ago and are retreating visibly year to year. We don't know how long they'll last, but quite likely in the next 100 to 200 years, there will be no glaciers left on Iceland.